Hi guys, it's Chris Carlidge here for DJ Tech Tools and I've got the video accompaniment to our new article which is called String Theory for DJs. And the reason it's called String Theory for DJs is because what we're looking at is a way to circumvent certain software's uh, limitations when it comes to doing multiple things at the same time. Tractor, for instance, has difficulties having more than one command when it comes to moving the playhead. And what we've done is used MIDI intermediary software. Uh, in the demos case, we've used MIDI pipe, but there's also plenty of other uh, software such as Bones MIDI Translator and MIDI OX that will allow you to put small delays in MIDI signals. And we're talking two or three milliseconds so that the software will actually interpret one button press as two extremely quick button presses. It will be faster than you can hear a change, but the software will still use it. Uh, that allows us to do things like, uh, in this case for this example here, we've got a uh, very basic functionality of Novation's Twitch slicer mode implemented directly into Tractor. And uh, what we've got here on this MIDI fighter is two buttons, one all layer Q and one all layer loop. I've already got a Q laid in. And these bottom eight buttons will reference that cue with the, fir with the first instance and then three milliseconds later, depending on the button, they'll beat jump to different points in the track. Uh, and that can give us the straight timing that you'll see here, like... Okay, so this is literally just the same timing, but we can... Etc. Okay, so what we'll actually do is give you a quick demo now so that we can see how that can be performed and uh, let's go. Okay, and if you head over to djtechtools.com, we've got the example files, the TSI and the MIDI pipe files that you can download, experiment with the concept, and we'd love to see what else you can come up with. Thanks for watching.